All for one. It's good to be in Grand Bahama. I recognize Senator Crazy, my parliamentary colleagues, Senator Fred Mitchell, who has been a staple of this event for many, many years. I'm grateful for the opportunity today to represent the Progressive Liberal Party. The labor movement and the Progressive Liberal Party have had a long history of being joined to the hip, as we say. The labor movement goes back almost 80 years to the Burma Road Riot in 1942 and June 1st. But today, the struggle continues. So today, I recognize all of the leaders of the various unions represented here today who continue the fight for the people. I am delighted to be here in Freeport, Grand Bahama, to lock hands with parliamentary colleagues from both sides on behalf of the people. We are committed to bringing the, the type of relief to the Bahamian people that improves their quality of life, improves their standard of living, improves labor relations overall, improve, improves the quality of work and the quality of benefits for all. As I say in Parliament, we truly believe that a rising tide will float all boats. And this is why I'm so happy to be here today, to lend my support to the people of Grand Bahama. I recognize that you have your share of challenges. I recognize that there is unemployment across the country and it's increasing. And I recognize in Grand Bahama, you have your share of challenges as well. So when I was invited to be here by the labor union today, I thought it important that I accept the invitation. So I bring greetings on behalf of the leader of the opposition, the Honorable Philip Brave Davis, who is marching in Nassau today with the labor union. And we want the people of Grand Bahama to know that we understand that Nassau in the Bahamas, and the Bahamas in just Nassau. So this is why it's extremely important for me to be here with you today. Now I have to tell you that I have become increasingly concerned about the unprecedented level of union unrest in our country of late. We see unhappiness in many of the unions. The nurses, the hotels, the teachers, BTC, BPL, water and sewage, taxi drivers, the list goes on and on. We stand with you. We stand in support with you. We trust that in your negotiations on behalf of your workers and on behalf of the Bahamian people, we recognize that we do so in solidarity for the betterment of the people and the betterment of Grand Bahama and the betterment of the Bahamas. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. I'm happy to be here and I enjoyed the exercise today. This is my first time, but I guarantee you this won't be my last. Thank you very much.